there are so many hidden places in North Carolina where you can walk in the footsteps of the Underground Railroad. These were pathways to emancipation for enslaved people. In tonight's WRAL Hidden History segment, Ken Smith takes us to a place with lost remnants of small colonies that freedom seekers called home. The Dismal Swamp belies its name. Today, a popular place for hiking and boating, well, there was a time when this wetland wasn't so safe. Well, the swamp in the 1800s was considerably larger than what we have today. It's about a tenth of its original size now, so it was huge. Bears, bobcats, alligators, and snakes were just a few of the dangers. Mosquitoes and ticks carried potential for disease. The land itself was treacherous to navigate for freedom seekers as well. So you might be walking and literally take a step forward, put your foot down and sink up to your deck in the muck. The quagmire of the dismal swamp, though, actually made it a safe place where freedom seekers could escape and likely not be followed by those trying to capture them. Maps show the Underground Railroad's pathway through the dismal swamp to freedom. History shows some freedom seekers decided to stay in the swamp, carving out their own free communities on islands known as maroon colonies. In the past, there would have been a lot more cypress and cedar trees than what you see. Then they would have been able to use those same trees to hopefully construct structures to shelter themselves. This artwork depicts the shelters as little more than a wooden lean-to without four walls to protect against the elements. The people living in this swamp village survived by competing with predators for small game and growing gardens along their homes. They were resourceful. I believe they were supposed to have reused Native American tools that were left behind. Life wasn't easy, but they were free, living simply and in secret. Because that was ultimately what it all came down to for them, was being able to live in freedom, even if it was here in the swamp, you know, with a, a difficult existence. Ken Smith, WREL News. It's unbelievable courage it took to do that. Well, you can visit the Dismal Swamp State Park in Camden County. There you'll see an exhibit on the Underground Railroad's role in the history of that park. For more photos and history of the Underground Railroad, you can go to WRAL.com and just search Hidden History. You can also listen to more of our interview with Parker Ranger, Katie Sanford in the WRAL Daily Download Podcast. It's available now in Apple Podcasts or go to WRAL.com and just search podcast.